In this week's tip, I want to give you a quick refresher on using photos in a word processing document. When I insert a photo or an image into a document, it pushes the text automatically above and below the image. So the first thing you want to do is change what's called the wrapping. In this demonstration, I'm using Word 2007. So we're going to go up here to the top in the menus. We're going to click Text Wrapping here. And under Text Wrapping, you get all kinds of different options. More often than not, the square is what you're looking for. So let's go back down to the image. And you can see now that my image, I can move it around, and it actually wraps the text around the image instead of above and below it. So let's put it over here on the left-hand side. And then, of course, you have your handles here that you can use to resize the picture. But one other quick thing I was really wanting to show you today was how to crop the picture. You don't have to crop it outside in another program. Most word processors give you the ability to crop the photo inside the document. So we're going to slide, we're going to keep the photo highlighted, and we're going to slide back up to the format menu here in Word 2007 and you're going to see that there's a crop option right here. So we're going to click crop and you can see once after we clicked crop we have a little different set of handles around the edges. So if I want to leave just my logo I can click here on the right hand side and push in and you can actually see the dotted line is going to crop out for me the text that I don't want to see any longer. So that's how you can use the crop tool in a word processor to make an image fit exactly the way you want it to fit.